Hey guys, so <clears throat> I'm gonna start painting this uh, HG Rosen Zulu. And this is like the normal color layout of the uh, Gundam, but we're gonna go with a, diff a few different colors. The dark or like the main purple, we're gonna use this Mr. Color uh, Clear GX 107. It's kind of like a satin type of purple. And for the off, like the lighter minority color, we're gonna use this pink GX 105. Um, the other option, there were, there were a couple of other, other paint options I wanted to use, but I just stuck with that uh, brand and type of paints to keep um, the texture of the model the same. Um, the other paint that I will be using is this uh, Sunburst, Glossy Sunburst Testers Enamel. Um, and I will be using Alclad Glossy Black Base. This is enamel base, but you don't need to put primer. And I'll be using Chrome. So for most of the project, I'll go black, Glossy Black. Um, then I'll put a Chrome layer on top. And then I'll put the top coat, which will be one of these three top coats. Um, <clears throat> to give you an idea of what we're working with. These haven't been sanded completely yet, but I just want to document what I do on video so that in the future, if I ever want to recreate a color, I know exactly how to do it. Um, so here is the secondary color. This is going to be painted the hot pink um, with the GX pink or whatever. Um, these brown pieces here and these thrusters they will be painted chrome so they'll go they'll have a glossy black base chrome and they'll be just left like this uh, like i said these will go be glossy black base and then they will be chromed and then the gx pink will be put on top of that these right here will be these are a little these and the main parts are a little bit different so these will be the glossy black owl clad base um but instead of putting the chrome layer, what will happen is I'll use the stickers to go on the outside or to go on the, the boundaries of this thing to mask out the outline. And then after that, I will spray the sunburst glossy testers enamel on top of that. And then I'll remove the sticker, you know, which will act like a small mask on the borders of these. So these pieces will be a glossy orange with like a black outline. Okay, so that's where these bluish type of pieces that you see here. And here, finally, for these darker primary pieces, and let me just grab a few here to kind of show you what I'm talking about. Let's take, I'm gonna take these two pieces. <clears throat> so these will be glossy black base with chrome, and then um, we'll use the GX purple, Mr. Color Purple on the top. Now. I don't know if you can see these, but like the other pieces, they have an outline, like where, you know, like a outline color would be. So for these, we'll do the same thing. These will go glossy black. Then I'll put the stickers or whatever to mask the outline. Then I'll put the chrome on top and then I'll put the top coat on top. So that, that's the way I'm gonna work this project. That seems the easiest way so everything here is going to be glossy black so basically first thing to happen is we're going to paint everything black today then tomorrow uh, as the paint cures i will start masking the stickers on the parts that will need it then on that day i'll spray the chrome on everything since everything will have or i'll spray the chrome on everything except these blue pieces and on these pieces i'll put orange and they'll be done and then once the chrome cures um, these pieces will be done then I'll put the top coat of the GX paints on these two and that should be the entire project so uh, we'll see how those turn out 